Hey guys, EVP Man here, and today we're going to talk about a power tip for the Samsung One UI, especially on the Note 9. I've been using it for the past week, and one of the things I've been trying to figure out is how do I multi-window and multitask? This is a power tip, and if you like using multi-windows, you'll want to watch this video. All right, so let's go ahead and talk about multi-window and multitasking. Why do you want to use them or, or why would you be interested in it? So first of all, the multitasking gives you the ability to switch between apps really quickly, but the multi-window gives you the ability to have two apps running at the same time. So you're literally going to be able to have, let's say, for example, Google Maps running and then the, your contacts open at the same time. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and tap the little bell icon to get notified when new videos become available. So you can see the map and you can see your contact. In my case, I get a lot of uh, conference calls that I have to be on. So being able to see the conference number that has a bridge tied to it uh, with my dialer at the same time is important because sometimes you have these really long numbers that you have to either copy, paste, or memorize. So what I do is I open up my email on the top and then I have my dialer on the bottom and then that way I can put in whatever prompts I have to do or pass codes to log in. So let me show you how that works. So here we have our Note 9, and what we're going to be doing is uh, tapping our multitask button, right? So what you see now in this area is all these shortcuts on the bottom. Now I can swipe left or right, as you can see here, to go to the app that I want, or what I can do is I can tap on any of these buttons to get to the specific app I want to get to even faster. So if I type tap the Skype, I'm going to jump in Skype. If I tap the Outlook, I'll get to Outlook. If, whatever I tap to, I'm going to jump directly into it. So how do you get multi-windowing? Let me show you this. You're going to press and hold here. And when you press and hold there, you have the ability to open in split view or open in pop-up view. Pop-up view is going to be the hover view. This is going to be like in Windows where you have these, you know, these windows all over the place. This also is possible on the Mac. So you'll be able to do that. But if you do open and split view, it's going to bring it to the top and then ask you what is the next application you want. So when I, as soon as I choose it, you'll notice now I have one application up here and I have one application down here. Both of them I can interact with. So if I'm looking at, let's say for example, an email that I have a conference bridge that I have to tap uh, or type, what I could do is I can see that while I have the dialer on the bottom area. So this is the multi-window functionality that had been missing I just couldn't find. So if you are done with the app, what all you have to do is swipe down like this, and then what happens is that primary app stays in place. And remember, you can always press home, or what you could do is you can press that uh, multitasking button on the side to get those windows back. So guys, what did you think about that power tip? It was taking me days to figure this out. So if you have a power tip that you'd like to share, make sure you share that in the comment area below. And as always, don't forget to share and subscribe. And don't forget, we are going to be live in San Francisco covering the Samsung Galaxy S10 event um, in the few weeks to come. So make sure you subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.